About a dozen homes destroyed, several of them completely leveled after a deadly tornado ripped through parts of St. Charles. People in St. Charles County woke up Saturday morning to incomprehensible damage. A tornado touched down in defiance near Route 94 around 8 p.m. Friday night, leveling these two homes and several others. Two people were injured. One was killed. We did have one fatality here uh, at the residence behind us. Um, her husband was also injured. They were elderly. Uh, they were on the first level of the home. Um, one was in bed and uh, one was uh, apparently up getting a glass of water. Strong winds blew the house across the field. They were 100 yards away when they were found. The woman was transported to the hospital where she passed away. A barn on Highway F had collapsed. One person was trapped inside along with five horses. The person was rescued. Two horses unfortunately died. The damage along Highway F was extreme. I mean, I've never seen anything like this. I mean, the amount of the trees that were split like toothpicks is insane. When the sirens go off, go to your basement. Tony Frisilla is the manager of Frisilla Nursery in Defiance. He said he's never experienced anything like this. Trees and debris filled the road on his way to the nursery. It took us about two hours to even get enough trees cleared to get to this area. And uh, I mean, I've never seen anything like this. First responders told us they saw about a three mile stretch of damage that seemed to follow the highway. Five to ten homes were leveled and about 25 homes were damaged. A friend of the homeowners at the corner of 94 and F told us family went to the basement when they heard the warnings and they were lucky they did because the rest of the house was destroyed. Power crews worked for hours to repair damaged lines. And we've uh, uh, relied heavily upon uh, the, the, the professionals, uh, including we want to thank uh, Amron and Quiver River for getting out here and uh, the only thing holding us back last night was the power lines that were on the road and, and we really couldn't send our people out to start clearing the roads until they got here. Priscilla says the business sustained damage, but they were lucky. Some friends of mine uh, in this area, they had lost their homes. I mean, for the most part, us, our glass greenhouse, glass and wind don't mix, so obviously it took a lot of damage. The roof took some damage. A couple of greenhouses came out of the ground, but I mean, for all in all, compared to everybody else, we, we fared, we did fare pretty well. We have uh, asked for the assistance of AmeriCorps, the Salvation Army, uh, the Red Cross, and uh, other volunteer organizations who are on their way out here. In Defiance, I'm Ala Araby.